Right. Good evening, guys. So, the previous session, we have discussed a program which fetches all words which contains a even number of characters. Okay. That is done. Now, let us see a new program. That is, I want to fetch all the words which starts with an vowel. Which starts with an vowel, guys. Okay. It starts with a, an vowel. Right. Let me take the question number nine. So write a program, a program, right? To fetch, to fetch all words, all words which starts with the, starts with the, an vowel, an vowel. Okay. For example. Let's take the string. Let's take, for example, Python is simple. Okay, simple. All of you, simple and uh, and uh, easy, easy language like this. Python is simple and uh, easy language. So here I have taken some words. Some words. Each word has characters. Okay, and from here. The word which starts with the, which starts with the, an vowel, that word I want to fetch, right? That means, so let's see the first Python, guys. Let's see first Python. Okay, in Python, take the first character, check it now, is it vowel or not? If it's vowel, then I want to fetch. Next, so next one is, is, is the right? And check here, is it vowel, first one, vowel or not? Next one, take the simple, and again from simple, take the first character, first character, right? Yes. And like this, from every word, you take the first character and you check it, is it vowel or not? Is it vowel or not? If it's vowel, then that word we want to fetch in the result, okay? To do that one, first what we do, we have to split, right? Where our space is there, there you have to split uh, so that it becomes a list with all words, uh, list with uh, all words like this. From that list, I can fetch one by one word. From each word, we check the, the first character. From each word, we check the first character, right? So for that one, I'm going to take now ST, ST, right? Uh, what is ST? Dot split, uh, ST dot split. Uh, ST dot split equal to suppose ST1 guys, right? ST1. What is ST? What is ST here? ST means uh, the given string, right? The given string. The given string, I'm splitting uh, wherever space is there. By default, space is there here. If you don't specify either comma or either, uh, uh, okay, any specific character, suppose uh, I can take the comma like this. What does it mean? Uh, Wherever comma is there in the given string, uh, there I want to make the split. We can take the comma, we can take the okay uh, space like this, or we take the any specific character like this. If you don't take anything, by default space is there, right? Space is there. Now the result of this one is result of that one of splitting. First time, first one uh, Python will come. Next, uh, next uh, separately is uh, is will come. Next one, uh, simple, simple, okay. Next one, uh, simple, right. Next one, uh, and, right. Next, uh, easy, easy, and, uh, right, language, language will come like this. Okay, the single string became list uh, with all words, with all words, uh, okay. Now, from this list, I want to fetch one by one word. Uh, that means from the ST1, okay. So for i in st1, i in st1, what is i value first time? The st1, what is i value? i value is Python. i value is Python, okay, Python. What is i value? i value Python. So in that Python, all of you guys, what is i value first time? i value is Python coming as single string. i value is Python, right, Python, a string guys. I is a string, right? Uh, I is a string. So in this case, again, uh, index number 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 
that means i of 0 is p i of 0 means p i of uh, i of 0 means what guys 0 means uh, p right i of 1 1 means what 1 means uh, y like this okay now what do i do i take the i of 0 means the first character if i of 0 if uh, if i of 0 in uh, i want to check in the vowels a e i o u lowercase vowels and cap letters uh, a e i o u j e j e i o u that's all right if uh, i of o i of 0 what is i of 0 first time p if p in vowels uh, then i want to print that one i want to print uh, that i if p suppose not available then skip it guys skip it next time uh, next iteration next i value what here next i value is uh, is like this next i value is next i value i value is okay now again i of zero what here i i now i in the vowels yes it is available right available now what happens here that i value will come in the result guys okay that i is what here is a uh, will come in the result iteration over next iteration i value what here simple next i value is the simple right i value simple i of zero means what uh, yes now if yes in the vowels are true or false false that will not print up next iteration next i value for next i value under so each time uh, the for i value keep on uh, take next value okay so under will come under so what is the i value now under i of zero means what here small a now here small a is there all of you if you remember i have taken uh, the combination of upper and lower as a first character right so see upper case here upper case here upper case yes upper so lower case a have taken uh, upper case e upper case l so both cases are there in the, in the beginning that's why i have taken uh, lower case vowels upper case vowels also all of you okay right or else what can we do here i can take the all lower case all lower case right now so i of zero means what here okay first one coming right means uh, it can be upper or lower all of right it can be upper it can be upper or it can be lower also whatever it is uh, i'm comparing with the lower case right then uh, whatever the first character may be upper or lower that i'm taking to lower case then uh, check in the vowels now i of zero what is i of zero capital p that capital p take me to lower now it becomes a small case p small p check in the vowels not there next i value capital i zero means capital i take into lower now small i small i then available that will print okay next one now uh, capital s coming capital s uh, take into lower no small s check in the lower case vowels uh, like this okay, all of you we can take like this also let me run this one let me run this one right you can see now so is and easy are the which one now the words which starts with the upper sorry starts with the vowel guys starts with the vowel okay a lot of you guys right so for the same one we can take the okay, line by line also guys as we know right as we know that we can take the line by line also line by line also guys <clears throat> so let me take here just a two one minute guys this one so first time uh, i value right i value first one i value then now uh, what is that i of zero i'm taking the i of zero the same i of zero i of zero this is the i of uh, i of zero guys the i of zero i are taking now i of uh, zero dot lawyer right lawyer guys lawyer then now uh, i'm taking now the printer okay you see this one all of 
So we are checking it right now. I'm checking here if okay, if also guys, I'm checking the if also here. Right. Let me try this one. What's I value here first time? I value first time Python at capital P Python. Now I of zero, how much here capital P? That I of zero taking to lower than small p. That small p, okay, if a small p in the vowels are true or false, this is the false. This is the false. There no print guys, okay? No print all of you. This is the false, this is the false, so no printer. Next one, I value what here? I value is a capital S. From there, what is zero? Zero means capital I. Capital I taken to lower than a small i, lower case i. The cap lower case i in the vowels are true or false. This is true. If true means uh, that word printing, I guess, is okay, is printing, guys. Next one, uh, simple, right? Uh, simple. What's the i? I of zero, yes. Then uh, the taken to lower, small s. Yes. Then true or false, uh, small s yes in lower, true or false, false. Then I will not take that. Okay. Next one, uh, under small case, right? Uh, I, have, I have zero, small a, right? Uh, of course, also same small a is there. Uh, true or false, uh, this is true. Then uh, under will come, guys. So small a, right? Under will come. Next one, uh, easy, capital Y, E. Then first one, uh, E. Then if convert to that E into lower, then small E. Then check it, uh, true or false, it's available true. Then uh, that I display, I means easy, capital right? Next one, language. Language, capital L, uh, taken to lower, small L. Then uh, it's available, no, false, right? Next, no other words are there. So finally, is and easy is the result, guys. Okay. Yeah. Thanks so much, all of you guys. Bye.